What up, y'all? Eric Creel, the Reviewer King in Savage 2002. I'm here today to review the Secret of Pets 2 for its first year anniversary. Let's get started. So, the plot we have Max and Duke are become friends, and then when Kay is going to get married from the new man, and then we have Liam. And then, when basically, when Max saw Busy Bee, and then when Max to give Busy Bee with Gidget. And then suddenly happens is when Gidget becomes to train like a cat. And then suddenly when Gidget founds a kid in mansion. And then when Captain Snowball meets Daisy. And then when suddenly happens is when Max and Duke are going to take a trip to the farm with Rooster. And then when suddenly, when Captain Snowball and Daisy want to find a way for Sergei Circus. And then when suddenly, when Max and Duke finally saw a perfect time with Rooster. And then when suddenly happens is when Max and Duke need to help a perfect time for the good times for Rooster. And then when suddenly when Captain Snowball and Daisy talks with the children and including Pops. And then when suddenly when Max and Duke never give up until when Max is going to save the time while they come back home. Soon as Sergei got defeated and also Circus Monkey got defeated when... Max and all the other pets are coming back home to Brooklyn. And then when Max and Duke have a good time when Liam goes to the daycare. And then when Captain Snowball sings the panda rap song. And that's pretty much the plot. What have I heard of the sequel? It's even better than the original. This is I saw in Cinemark XD on June 8th of 2019. It was even better than the first one. The animation looks so awesome. The story, very cool. And the characters we have, Max, the main character. He's awesome. The same person who played Remy from Ratatouille. And then we have Duke. He's awesome. Gidget, she's nice and cute. And then we have Pops. He's awesome, including the kids. They are nice. And then we have Captain Snowball. He is awesome more to do. And then we have Daisy. She's awesome. Played by the same person who played Queen Whatever Wannabe from the Lego Movie 2. And then we have Rooster. My favorite character of the film. Same person who played Han Solo from Star Wars. And then we have Mel. He's cool. Buddy. He's awesome. And then we have uh, Pipsqueak. So awesome. And yes, all the other kinds of pets look so awesome. Including the circus monkey. The circus monkey is pretty funny. And including Sir J. He's awesome. The same person who played Uncle Fester from the Adams Family 2019. And then we have... Uh, all the other characters look so awesome, including the music scores. They are awesome. And including, you know what this including? The panda rap song played by Captain Snowball. It's awesome. And then we have the rest of the musics. They are awesome. Do I have issues and negatives? Nope. Even better than the first film. It gets a plus 70,000 out of 10. And it gets the Seal of Epic Masterpiece. So, hope you all enjoy it. Tomorrow is Final Space TV Show Review. Bye!